somebody somebody is definitely on the move to leave okay um somebody here um is really looking for a reason okay to walk away here somebody has really had enough but you know it's a feeling of moving in silence okay it's a feeling of not letting somebody know what they're doing okay somebody is they're plotting, they're planning, okay, on leaving, okay? They're making it seem like it's all good, okay? They're not showing their hand here, all right? Um, somebody definitely, when they get ready to leave here, they're not going to be leaving empty-handed. You need to understand that, okay? Uh, somebody is definitely here for some money. Somebody has been um, spending money. Somebody has been saving money. Somebody has been putting money to the side. Somebody has been doing something with some money, okay? That is going to benefit them when they leave, all right? Um, they're, they're, they're trying to move on, okay? This person is at their wit's ends, okay, with somebody. It's not even of energy of I like you, okay? This person could be married. This person could be a higher connection, a baby mom, a baby dad, whatever the case may be, okay? But it's a really an energy of I really can't stand you for real, okay? I'm just really trying to... You know, get to the point to where my shit is right, all right? And and then that's what I'm going to make my move. This this right here is serious. And, and somebody is really dirt, dirt digging, okay? They're really looking for a reason, okay? They're looking for some, some type of evidence or something to where they can make a, a move without um, letting you know, okay? Or vice versa, shit, I don't know. Um, but I know somebody has had enough, okay? They've had enough confusion, all right? They've had enough of being self-imposed prison. They had enough of being imprisoned by somebody's lies, somebody promiscu prom promiscuousness, somebody's habits, somebody leaving somebody out, somebody walking away, somebody being cold, somebody's intimidation, somebody's flip molding, somebody's deception, the conflict, the cowardness, the hostility, the pride, somebody is tired, okay? And they're tired. You know what, y'all? This is not a, a I'm just tired of your ass type energy, okay? This is, I'm tired of your ass and I don't even have shit else to say to you, for real, okay? This is not a, um, we can discuss this. You see what I'm saying? Or I feel the need to bring it to your attention. No, they're they're beyond that, okay? They're, they're ready to make a move, is what I'm trying to say, all right? They're trying to move on. They're balancing, okay? They're balancing it out, okay? Because the time is not right. They're waiting, they're waiting for the time to be right, okay? To bust the move is what they're doing, okay? <laughs> they're waiting for the moment, all right? And, um, yeah, so they're balancing, okay? They're juggling, okay? Adapting, okay? Adapting to what? Adapting to this deception. Adapting to this abandonment. This left out, walked away, being cold, these habits, okay? Listen, they're going to be walking away, and it's going to be final, all right, when they do, all right? Profit and loss, financial stress, flexibility. That has something to do with it, okay? One word, all words, no words. Somebody is really, really hoping, um, having faith and manifesting balance, okay? They're manifesting balance, harmony, and peace. They want to throw the deuces up, okay? They want to detach from this here family, okay? From this here, you know, uh, marriage, okay? Um, higher connection, baby mom, baby dad, what, whatever, okay? They, they, they're talking about somebody here, all right? You didn't understand that. Uh, Aries, if this is you, you sitting up here talking about this person who you with, all right? And you letting people know, soon as the time is right, okay, my ass is up out of here, all right? You need to understand that. Somebody is saying that, okay? If it's not you, Aries, then that's what they're saying about you, okay? Yeah, they waiting for some money, though, I tell you that much, okay? They ain't leaving broke. I'm not, look, I'm just, no, I'm just saying. They're not leaving broke. Understand that there's so this this is your this is your man, this is your woman sitting there in that chair waiting on the right time, okay? They're not leaving broke. You need to understand that. That's that's <laughs> that's not negotiable right there, okay? That's it's not negotiable, okay? So yeah, they're tired of this confusion, okay? They're tired of feeling uncertain, they're tired of feeling unclear, they're tired of feeling unsure, okay, about everything in this relationship for real, for real, okay? I love you too, baby. <laughs> self imposed prison, anxiety, fear, helpless, feeling trapped, powerless, victimized. They said they ain't chasing nobody no more. That's what they said, okay? They're saying, I'm not chasing shit, okay, at all. The only thing that I'm willing to chase is my future. That's it, without you. That's that's the only thing I'm willing to chase. This is the energy, okay? Somebody is past fed up, okay? Like I said, it's the energy of somebody don't like somebody. I mean, you could literally be with your husband, your wife, and you really just don't like their ass. I mean, really, this is the energy of it, okay? 
Yeah, because somebody acts single out here in this world, all right, when they ain't, okay? That's why. And they got habits and shit, okay? Habits that cause somebody to feel left out. They're very deceitful. They're very secretive, okay? They spend money in places where, who knows, okay, where they spend the money, okay? This person is possibly self-reliant. This person is possibly, you know, very uh, stable here, okay? Because I got marrying for money here. I got somebody sitting here waiting on the perfect time to leave and to take the money. Um, so, of course, a lot of y'all is going to be dealing with a very successful individual, okay? Um, that has material uh, security, okay? And very self-reliant, all right? This, this is not you. This is somebody else, okay? Somebody's regretful. Somebody, I, and, and let me tell you something. As I meditated over this energy, because I got regretful, I got mistakes and mistakes. I don't think they're regretful for what they did, okay? I think they're reg regretful for fucking with the person in the first place, okay? I think they're regretful for this union is what I really think they're regretful for. I believe that somebody feels that they made a mistake in dealing with somebody in the first place. That's just how I feel, okay? I could be completely wrong, okay? But I'm telling you the way this is lined up, it don't feel like that, okay? Um, because somebody is thinking, you know, the only thing that I have, uh, you know, really been through here with this individual is having to surrender. Okay. Having to surrender my belief system, having to surrender my integrity, having to surrender my respect factor. Shit. I didn't have to surrender a lot of shit. It's been conflict. Okay. It's been winning at all costs here. Right. Pride is the most shit. I know I'm better off without this individual. Okay. Somebody's perspective is this way. Somebody feels that they're better off without this person. They feel like they can have happiness without this individual. They feel like without this individual, they will have a clear headspace. Okay? They feel that way. All right? Somebody fixing to leave somebody. Or somebody wants to. They're preparing. But they ain't leaving empty-handed. I'm going to tell you that right now. Okay? Somebody absent. Okay? That's, one of, that's another problem here. Okay? Somebody is absent, okay? So even if they're there, they're not there, okay? They're doing shit that they don't have any business doing, okay? That's number one. Number two, it's not any depth there, okay? There's no um, substance here. It's no affection. And if that affection is affection, it's very... Somebody can't feel it. It's like... I just don't feel this. I'm not feeling this. You see what I'm saying? There is attachments and influences, okay? There are party situations, friends and family that condone, you know, this situation. There is somebody here, like I said, that is preparing. That's going to be true for some of you. It's going to be true for some of you that somebody is fucking around on their job. It's going to be true for some of you that somebody has an attachment third party situations when it has something concerning their career, when it has something to do with their work, okay? And this party is, this person is very much so influenced by certain individuals whatever attachments they have third parties or peers when it comes down to this eight of pentacles when it comes down to this work okay for some of you this absence will be work somebody may be calling off a lot or somebody may um you know been laid off for per, perhaps because i do have this card here and it does say broke ass okay and a wallet empty okay so for some of you guys with this absence in this job here somebody either lost the job or, um, you know, they've been laid off or they've been demoted or something to that degree, okay, when it comes down to the job, all right? But there is, for some of you, a lot of you, it will be definitely true that they are fucking around at their job, okay? Right. And this has caused a lot of confusion, okay? That is not the only thing that has caused confusion. Everything called, has caused confusion. Conflict, all right? Unruliness, ego clashing, obstacles, opposition, defensiveness, struggles, competition. Territorial. Yeah, like I said, somebody waiting here. They sure are. They're waiting. They're waiting to get the fuck on, y'all. I'm just saying. I don't know who this is. I don't know if this is you, Aries. I don't know if this is your person, okay? One of y'all, a third party cross watcher, I don't know, okay? All I know is they ain't leaving empty handed. That's what I can tell you, okay? So, um, yeah, we got Queen of Wands sitting right here. That would be you, okay? Or rather, you a dude or a female, all right? And it got mistakes surrounded. I mean, this is what it looked like. I got the Queen of Wands sitting in the middle, and I got two mistake cards on each side of the Queen of Wands, okay? All as I'm saying is somebody feels like they made a mistake, okay? So, I don't know. In my personal opinion, I feel like they made a mistake. Somebody feels like they made a mistake in messing with somebody in the first place, okay? 
But however, somebody could feel, for some of you, misunderstood. Somebody could feel like a victim, okay? And like somebody has lost their way, okay? Or somebody could say, I wish, somebody could feel like, I wish I could right my wrongs, okay? Like they made a mistake in this relationship, okay? That will be true for some of you as well, okay? But when it comes down to this here, family, gatherings, reunions, peaceful life, domestic bliss, happiness, security, marriage, higher connection, this love, okay? Somebody wants balance, harmony, okay? Somebody is detaching. Yeah, they're detaching, okay? I had to let this go so I could clear my mind. Somebody is stressed the fuck out dealing with somebody, okay? Like I said, it's the energy of somebody don't like somebody here, okay? Like, for real, for real. It's, it, it really do feel that way. Like, I know I'm with you, okay? But I don't like you. Yeah, it really just is that simple. And it really, to be honest with you, I am waiting. Do you hear me? Waiting on the time where I can leave your ass. And that's some real shit, okay? So I don't know, Aries. I don't know if this is your person. I don't know if, you know, I see somebody being fake. I see somebody being phony. I see somebody laughing and smiling, you know, making it seem like it's all good when it's not, okay? Like, you know, they may not be on somebody's ass here saying like, okay, well, you did this and you did that. And I'm tired. Of, they're tired of doing that. Okay, they're just smiling and moving in silence. Okay, yes, it's being fake and phony, it damn sure is, but at the same time, that's what they're doing. They're smiling and they're moving in silence. Okay, and what they're moving on to is to get their money right and waiting on this here time and some cycles um, to go past in the, the, the right moment to leave. That's what's going on. Okay, mm hmm. So that's what we dealing with y'all. My day ones, much love, train to go. Love you guys. My VIPs, you guys, thank you so much for being here with me. You guys, we're gonna dive right on in. Um, let me thank my new subscribers before we do, you guys. Um, my new subscribers, I thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. Listen, if you guys have not let me know that you're new, go in the comment section below. Let me know that you're new so I can give you a warm welcome that you desire, okay? Um, so, you guys, I've already prayed over these clarifiers in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I've asked for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection as I give Jesus Christ all the praise, the honor, and the glory, okay? So, this is what we're expecting. Somebody is saying, I want to, I'm, I'm hoping, like hell, anytime soon, I can throw these deuces up, okay? Yeah, because I'm tired of sitting up here wearing this this fake ass smile. All right, I I really just am. Okay, I'm tired of sitting up here giving to the situation. Okay, I I don't have any more energy to give. The energy that I am giving to the situation really is not coming from me. Okay, they're not getting the real me right now. Okay, somebody is saying that, rather you or somebody else. Okay, it's just that simple. Somebody is superficially giving. Okay. And for a long time. They've been wearing a smile for a long time. Okay? They've been sitting up here, got dang on, hoping and wishing and expecting a new chapter in their life for a long time. They have been sitting up here looking for dirt on somebody. Okay? Or vice versa. Does I don't know. Okay? And for a while is what I'm saying. Okay? They've been patient. Because like I said, they're not fixing to make no uncomfortable ass moves. They ain't fixing to do that. Okay? They're at a, um, a fork in the road. It's time. It's, they're going to be making the decision here shortly, okay? They need to know how they're going to progress, all right? They need to know what direction they're going to take, how they're going to do it, okay? You need to understand this person who I'm talking about, this person is not the type of person that gets angry and pack their shit and leave, okay? it ain't That ain't that type of individual, okay? This is the type of individual that will sit up here and laugh and smile with your ass, okay? And they'll act as if they don't have any problem at all knowing that you have done the absolute positive most, okay? Okay? And when the time is right, what will happen is, is you'll be going to work, okay? When you come back home, everything will be gone. You understand what I'm saying? Everything, okay? Just trying to let y'all feel me, okay? I mean, that's all I'm saying, okay? It was love here. What's the friendship? Somebody talking shit about somebody. Somebody talking about somebody here, okay? Somebody talking about fixing the lead their ass. That's what they talking about, okay? They're telling their friends and shit. Yeah, because they really is defensive. They're guarded. They're resistant. They're standing their ground. And they're talking about somebody here, okay? They're saying, I'm fixing to throw up the deuces. And I cannot wait, okay, until the time comes, all right, for me to make my move, all right? That's what they're saying. Right, so that I can get my happiness back, okay, with this here sun card, all right? Look, and sun under finality, okay? Listen, somebody is saying to themselves or saying to their friends or family or whatever that I'm ready to be happy again. I'm ready to make this final, okay? I'm ready to move on. This right here, I have been trying to move on. I want this new chapter in my life, okay? 
And I'm going to be very happy when I do. All right. This is enlightenment. Somebody could have, um, you know, this is conception as well. But, um, you know, this is confidence as well. Okay. Somebody is going to walk away because somebody, like I said, they're tired. Okay. They're ready to throw the deuces up. They want to say the farewell. They want to leave behind. They want closure. Okay. Close. It don't matter whether they have it or not. Okay. For real, for real. Okay. Um, but honestly, that's what they're going to be doing. Okay. Their closure is their closure. How they're going to be getting it. Okay. Rather it, right. You agree with it or rather, you know, you don't. Okay. Or vice versa. Okay. Um, but yeah, they're tired. They say they ain't chasing nobody no more. Okay. They said they ain't with that shit. Okay. They are where they are. Okay. They're with whoever. All right. They're going to be there. Okay. Even though it's a whole lot of fouls and shit and fighting and arguing and hostility and cowardness and shit going on. Okay. Ego clashing and competition and, and stuff like that. Okay. Um, you know, but they, they, they you know, they, they saying I'm not, I'm not willing to chase, you know, I, I just ain't willing to do that no more. Okay. I'm just telling you. They, they ain't with this shit no more, okay? They may were once upon a time, but they ain't with this shit no more now. I'm just telling you. Yeah, they're sitting up here waiting because they want their nine of cups by their damn self, okay? They want wishes granted by their self. They're emotionally blocked, okay? They have a decision to make. It's just that simple. They want stability and stuff by themselves. I told you they waiting to dip. Didn't I tell you that? Yeah, they waiting to dip. And when they do, they're going to take this here sun card and they're going to turn it into this nine of cups, okay? And they're going to live their life like it's gone. It's just that simple, okay? Because they say they don't like somebody happens here, all right? They have been left out long enough, okay? Somebody been caught. Somebody been walked away. Somebody has left somebody out here. Somebody who has achieved something person is a boss might be dealing with an older man here Aries Taurus showing up as a, as a straight boss out here acting single in this world yeah see this is the person right here whoever this person is okay this possibly older man okay or older female all right um, this is the one that's causing the conflict, the unruly, the ego clash, and the obstacles, the opposition, defensiveness, competition, struggles, territory, okay? Yeah, somebody is ready to eat, or this person has abandoned this person. They've left somebody out of something, maybe information or details. Maybe this is a habit that they have, or this abandoned card could just be that somebody is ready to abandon this here person, okay? Papa Swords, Holy Spirit, please. Somebody is in regret. This intimidation, this winning at all costs, this change, this deception, this conflict, this uh, cowardness, deception, pridefulness, somebody's in regret. Like I said, you know, for some of you guys, it will be some, you know, maybe somebody in regret for, you know, causing all of these energies right here, okay? But it's going to feel like, you know, I mean, it feels to me like, you know, somebody's in regret for messing with this person. Somebody knows that they're going to be better off without this person. They're going to have happiness because you know why? Because they're a burden. That's why. Okay. It's in the wants. This is a burden. Dealing with this individual is a stressed out burden to somebody. Okay. It's almost a feeling like, I don't know. I'm just imagining, right? Like, you know how you get off work, right? And you come home. And you're so used to coming home and that person is not there, right? But you just so happen to come home and you see their car in the driveway. And you 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 don't you're not ready to deal with that energy. So what you do is you you spin the block about four or five times preparing yourself to see this motherfucker. Okay, that's that's how serious this shit is. Like I can't even just you know, you can't just spring yourself on me like that, okay? It's the energy of I'm so sick and tired of you okay like honestly you know what i mean like you know i don't know y'all this this is ugly here okay this is this, this is really really ugly yeah somebody don't mind divorcing somebody at all okay at all somebody will take their ass to court somebody you know if a divorce is happening somebody damn sure is taking they want what they want okay they will have half okay they will have half if this is a divorce um you know this you know could be just you know Somebody balancing out the scales, you know, maybe somebody feels like somebody's habits or something cause too much confusion, too many hurt, third party situation, you know, maybe they're going to do it themselves, you know, maybe that's how they're going to balance the scales out. Nonetheless, I mean, you know, or, you know, maybe somebody wants to make a wrong or right, okay? Somebody might got a court case of some type of sort, okay? 
a lawsuit or something like that. Somebody's very optimistic here about their future. They want happiness. They want serenity. Like I said, they want balance and harmony, okay? And they want money. They want a windfall. I got marrying into money two times, all right? I'll take that. It's going to be true for a lot of you. I got it twice. I got an material in the world. Somebody about to hang somebody ass out to dry. And I'm going to tell you something. They ain't going to give a damn either because they in the four cups. They don't even give a fuck, okay? Not even a little bit, okay? They're very indifferent, okay? They don't give a fuck, okay? For real, for real. Even if somebody is in third party, I really don't even feel like they really give a fuck. It's almost like here they go again. Like, this is what they do. Like, this is the reason why I'm fixing to leave their ass and I'm fixing to take all their shit. That's, that's the reason, okay? Because this is what they do, okay? So when it comes down to them being absent, like I said, somebody might have lost their job, got laid off, something like that. Something that they really were passionate about. Something they really loved to do. Or something that they really were good at. Or they're sharing themselves with somebody here at the job. But it kind of feels like that. It feels like both for real. Okay. So it's going to be true for some of you that somebody lost a job. Or somebody got demoted or something to that degree. Okay. Or maybe somebody got hurt. Okay. At the job. All right. Because there's stagnation. There's limbo here. It's like to be determined. Okay. Like maybe somebody has to go find another job or if they're dealing with this job, you know, it's, it's almost like we'll call you if we need you type shit. Okay. Um, but when it comes down to some of you who is somebody is dealing with somebody at the job. Okay. Somebody might've got fucked up for dealing with somebody at their job. Okay. With this here hangman. Um, but nonetheless, you know, um, there's some type of stagnation and limbo when it comes down to this. Okay. Give me a little bit more because there is a third party here for some of you guys here. Yeah, that they're sitting up here juggling, okay? They're juggling this third party situation, this co-worker situation, okay? They're losing money too. Profit and loss. Adaptability, okay? Right, and this is betrayal beyond betrayal, you guys. This is backstabbing beyond backstabbing, okay? I guess that's why somebody's sitting here waiting. They like, shit, you out work fucking around, and I'm here. Okay, I'm waiting on you, okay? All right, okay. You going to keep on fucking around at work, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this here uh, justice card, and when I get ready to divorce you or leave you or whatever, you can best believe I won't be leaving empty-handed. I'm going to tell you that right now. They won't be leaving empty-handed. Five of Wands, Holy Spirit. Yeah, see? Somebody knows that this is what it is, okay? They 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 know this. They got mental clarity, okay? They 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 know, okay? It's almost like maybe I want once upon a time where they were like, okay, well, you know, maybe they're just making mistakes or they're giving somebody the benefit of doubt. They're no longer giving somebody the benefit of doubt anymore. They know that this is what this person brings. Aries is that this is you. They know that you bring this shit. They know that you bring conflict, that you bring ego clashing, obstacles, opposition, defensive, competition, territory, and struggles. That you bring confusion, okay? They know that. If this is somebody else, then you know it, okay? Like I said, Cross Watcher Energy Cannon will get involved in this. Cross Watcher, I want you guys to know that um, I love Cross Watchers just like I love Aries. And you guys are more than welcome to watch this video or any one of my other videos, you guys. Um, if this is Aries that's done this to you, please go in the comment section. Let me know. I'm very interested to know how your energy interchanges, okay? I'm chef. I'll let y'all know who on this board. Yeah, see? Somebody into socializing an awful lot. They love it, as a matter of fact, okay? Third-party situations, third-party interference, okay? Friends and family interfering, okay? Condoning this behavior, all right? Drinking, you know, partying, some of you. Tell about the Queen of Wands and some mistakes. Yeah, somebody to hit a tower. Love them blew up in somebody's face here. They're showing up as the Queen of Wands, Okay? Um, doesn't necessarily have to be a Leo Sagittarius or Aries. It's just that energy, that sexy, crazy, cool energy, okay? Um, it could be somewhere in the chart, all right, you guys? But nonetheless, and also Scorpio, too, could be somewhere in the chart, all right? Or have something to do with this. But not, love, love has blown up in somebody's face, all right? Upheaval, chaos, negativity has ensued. Damage has been done, okay? It's just that simple. And somebody feels like somebody made a mistake. Somebody feels like somebody is misunderstood. Somebody feels like 
like somebody is the victim, okay? Somebody wishes they can right their wrongs. And somebody feels, it feels like they should have never messed with somebody in the first damn place. I don't know which one, which is, okay? Right, because somebody say you toxic, okay? Whoever this is for, whether this is you or cross watcher or third party or whoever, you toxic, okay? You don't bring out the best in me, all right? You toxic, you negative, you full of restrictions, bondage, and also third parties. You, you, I'm just saying, you know, and you, you obsess. This is sex addiction right here, okay? All right? And not only sex addiction, this person fall in love easily as well, okay? So not only do they have a sex addiction, somebody here also really falls hard for like a third party, regardless of what the third party, very quickly, okay? To the point to where they put their main situation in jeopardy, okay? And this happens a lot, right? Because they like to romance folks, okay? They like to bat their eyes at people, all right? If they a female, yeah, they like that attention, right? Job coming back up, y'all, with this eight of coins, or they're just preparing to do something very quickly, very ambitious, seizing the moment. Got something to do with sex. Got something to do with having a strong bond with somebody. This is why I say these mistake cards, I really truly feel somebody like shit. I wish I would have never. That's my mistake. It's fucking with you, period, okay? Something different. Something's going to happen, okay? Tower is here. Will of Fortune is here, okay? This, I don't know if this is positive or negative. There's going to be a new beginning here, Okay? This is going to be a new beginning. This is going to be a new cycle, all right? Somebody's going to be very optimistic and jumping out here. Um, I told you before that somebody is hoping and wishing on the moment, okay, to walk away, to, to throw the deuces up, okay? Um, and maybe that's what this energy is. Maybe some with this di divine uh, fate, um, destiny, okay, a will of fortune, somebody is like, you know what? You know, this is my chance here, all right? Because somebody, like I said, is romancing somebody or batting their eyes at somebody over here, okay? Because somebody is ready to get in the full energy. That means they're ready to make it happen. They're ready to get it popping, okay? They're playing, all right? Empress is here. Baby mom, baby dad. But that could be you. What this is under uh, uh, um, Aries, um, Leo Sagittarius. Somebody know. Somebody got God given gifts. Somebody is. Somebody knows something. Somebody knows something on the table. Give me ten of cups, Holy Spirit, please. Somebody that took care of the home, the kids. Somebody's looking for a bright opportunity. They're looking for other options. They're looking for a bright prospect, other prospects, other opportunities to present themselves. Okay. Yeah, that they want to they want to go after and they want to attain. They want to win. They want to detach. Okay, so they're looking for other opportunities. But like I said, they're not going to be leaving broke. Okay, it's just that simple, right? They, somebody is about to leave somebody ass and cold here. Okay, they're about to turn their back on somebody. Okay, this is scandals, disgrace, hardship, misfortune, and loss. Okay, like I said, somebody if you're married and this is a divorce, they're gonna want half. Okay, just want you to know that. Um, but you know, if you're not, they're still going to be, they, they won't be leaving empty handed. I'm just telling you, it's too many cards here that says this. Okay. They're waiting. Okay. They're waiting for the perfect moment so they can be, you know, they want their transition to be as smooth as possible. Right. So they're in this place. Right. So when they make their move, the only thing they really have to do is really put their shit in their car and they're going to go to their other place that's already got the pots and the pans and the, 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 the um, towels and, you know, the paper towels and the ice trays that they done took from your shit. Um, you know, like all that because they're going to be taking everything. OK, so you need to understand that. So anyway, let me go ahead and give you I'm going to tell you all who's on the board. Like I said, I don't know who this is, Aries. And if it don't apply to you, it don't apply to you. I mean, puzzle pieces. You know what I'm saying? I didn't say that, y'all, because I be trying to get to the point. 
but puzzle pieces. Anytime you get jewelry from me, there's always puzzle pieces, okay? Take what resonates, leave it on. Let me get some letters for you guys, okay? If you guys come up with a message of any kind of sort, if you guys are a verified subscriber, go on ahead and, um, damn, we got two E's. Go ahead and put your uh, comment down here in the um, comment section. Your situation. And, uh, and I will randomly pull, okay? Uh, for my Train to Go members, this is automatic. Join Train to Go, you guys. It's a it's it's more of a tight knit community. I'm growing it. It's about healing. It's about self ascension, okay? It's about learning your gifts and going further in life, okay? The right way, the healed way, okay? All right. Bettering oneself, getting better every day, okay? Self ascension. And also, right now, it's one half off of my reads, one half off of my VIP plans, and also um, one free question a week, you guys. That's my train to go members, that's what they get. Um, and also, one one on one with me. A month, okay? So it is definitely worth it. All right, let's get you guys some numbers. And then I'm going to tell y'all who's on this board here. You guys, I really appreciate your super thanks, your support. I really appreciate you guys. Your subscriptions. Holy Spirit, some numbers. Get a little bit more. All right, y'all. So the numbers that we have here that may be relevant. Oh, we got another month here, too. Okay. It's the number 49, 94, 14, 41, 39, 93, 63, 36, 30, or number 3. 61, 16, number 2. 35, 53, 52, 25, 24, 42, 40. Or four. 75, 57, 23, or 32. Let me go ahead and say that one more time, okay? Whew. 23, 32. 75, 57. 40, or number four, 24, 42. 52, 25. 35, 53. Number two, 61, 16. 30, or number three, 63, 36, 39, 93. 14, 41, um, 49, or 94, okay? Y'all gotta excuse my son back there. He is having a ball, all right? Something um, may be relevant in the winter. And this may be last year or this coming up, okay? Winter time, December, May, June, April, February, and Mother's Day, okay? Mother's Day is going to be relevant for some of you guys. The month of February, all right? June, April, December, May, or winter time, okay? Now, the letters that I have is I have two E's. The letter B, the letter Y, the letter A, the letter X, the letter T, the letter I, and the letter M, okay? So two E's, the letter B, the letter Y, the letter A, the letter X, the letter I, the letter M, and the letter T. Okay? So let me tell y'all who's on the board here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. We got Pisces, Aries, Sagittarius. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, and um, Leo. 
Gemini, Capricorn, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Somebody ready to dip. This is good. They're going to find a happiness when they leave. Okay. They have a different perspective. They feel like they're better off without somebody here. Leo. Aquarius. Libra. Emperor. Aries. Taurus. Cancel Pisces. Scorpio. Libra. Excuse me. Leo. Sagittarius. Aries. Gemini. Okay? That's what I do have. So, hopefully, I was able to put one piece together for you. If I have, that means I've done my job, you guys. I would appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon.